And welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing something different and I've seen these videos and I personally really enjoy them So I thought I'd give it a go and see what you guys think But I've let my Instagram followers and my friends control my makeup for the day So basically I put a poll on Instagram for different bits of makeup and you guys voted either one or two sort of thing And which one you liked so I'm pretty much gonna do the like votes in and yeah You guys are gonna see the results. So let's get started. So I'm not currently wearing primer at the moment, I've just been wearing my moisturiser because um, my skin's quite dry at the moment. Before foundation, you guys chose me to use the Too Faced Born This Way um, over the Nip Fab one. So yeah, let's see how this goes. I really should get a new foundation soon because I feel like I'm running low and Too Faced is an amazing foundation. It's sort of medium coverage but you can build it up. I actually had to go and wash my hands, I accidentally put too much foundation on them. So for the next one, you guys chose the Revolution Concealer over the Primark Stick, which is actually really good coverage too, but I literally adore this. It is so good, it's such full coverage, I actually use it to carve out my brows too, and I think this was around £4, so I recommend this. Also along with the Collection Lasting Perfection, which I need to repurchase, but I haven't had a chance to, so yeah. <laughs> For my brows, you guys um, voted the Revolution uh, Pomade, and this one is in dark brown. Yeah, dark brown, as obviously I have black hair. Excuse the braids. So I had to braid them before work last night, and I've stayed in. I have work tonight. Weird on a Wednesday night, but it's for the World Cup, so I'm kind of excited. Um, I'm going to go in with, yeah, I think I'm just going to comb them first. I really need to actually go and get my eyebrows threaded. Shout out to Expose um, Eyebrow Brush. I'm pretty sure it's actually an eyeliner one because it's so fine. But it's absolutely amazing for defining brows. I quickly did my other brow off cam because I felt like it was going to take me ages as they actually really need like threading. I've plucked the worst ones out but I quickly did them off cam. Oh my god, they really need plucking. I feel like I've got slugs going on. But yeah, that is my brows done and on to eyeshadow. You actually chose the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette and you guys haven't actually seen me use this in ages. So I'm not sure what tones to go for but as it's the World Cup, I feel like I should go for red. But 
I'm still thinking maybe a pinkish look because you guys chose um, a lipstick that goes with it. So yeah, I think I'm going to go with the pink tones in it and let's get started. To mascara i gave you the vote between the maybelline which is the double-ended one you guys would have seen in my last video and the Too faced better than sex mascara and you guys voted the Too faced one i do rate this mascara i do need to repurchase it as this one feels like it's going like drying out a little bit so let's see how this one goes actually feeling this look I'm not gonna lie but on to the next one I let you choose my contour and I have the 17 and the Too Faced chocolate soy lit soy lil? I can never pronounce this but I literally love this and it smells so good I actually got this in um, a ship it when I shipped over like a few bits from their company um, they give you two free samples when you order from the original Too Faced site and this was one of the samples that I uh, chose On to highlight, I gave you the choice between the Topshop one in Sunbeam and the MUA one in Peach Diamond and you guys know I adore this highlighter and actually it goes quite well with this look as it's pink toned. thing you guys chose so I put out two nude lipsticks this one is the one you guys chose this is the Kiko in number one which I bought a few weeks ago if you've watched my recent haul um, you'll know if you haven't go check it out because it was pretty fabulous and the choice between the MUA nude one I want to say it's in bare but I'm not actually too sure but you guys chose this one which I really like I feel like this lipstick has like an orange tinge to it, but I really like it. I also decided to quickly take my braids out. This is the final look you guys voted for. And oh my god, I actually love it. I'm not gonna brush it this time. Last time I brushed it, it was out here. I'm actually feeling the beach waves. They're kind of cute. I actually should do this more often because I like love curling my hair, but I can't be asked to do it. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go and give it a big thumbs up. Click subscribe. Uh, subscribe. I really can't speak again today. Send help. Um, go click subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video.